heard you the first time. Well, 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 if it ain't Mrs. Charlie herself, what am I being falsely accused of now, your whiteness? Uh, I'm sorry, are you a, a Mr. Homie D. Clown? No, I'm Harry D. Frog. Oh. Uh, yes, I've heard about you. I'm from the Department of Social Services, and I have someone I'd like you to meet. This is Homie Junior. <laughs> <laughs> so let I get this straight. I'm supposed to believe that this kid is mine just because you slap a red nose on his face and paint a smile on his lips? I don't think so. <laughs> Homie, don't play that. That's all right, Hobie Jr. I know a very nice white family that would be all too thrilled to have a little son. So let me get this straight. You gotta let them stick me in some white family who would treat me like Webster? I don't think so. <laughs> so, Dad. Well, isn't that just a... The bitch finally tracked me down. I guess we got a lot of catching up to do, son. Have a seat. Let me tell you about Whitey. <laughs> Do the wave with us. Oh, yeah, join in the fun with all the nice folks. That's the spirit. <laughs> Stand up and wave our hands in the air. Yeah, it's fun. <laughs> Debate ourselves and sacrifice our dignity and act like a jackass just like you. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> oh, we don't play that. <laughs> and that's the story of Goldilocks and the Three Bears. So the moral of the story is that women can't be trusted, huh, Dad? No, white women can't be trusted. <laughs> Let's play a game. Okay. This game is called The Man's Monopoly. I'll be the chewing gum and you be the Cheeto. Okay, you go first. Move five spaces. One, two, three, four, five. Ah, you've landed on Bobo's Park Place. I want to buy it. Now, how can you buy it if you're only making minimum wage and you got a wife and two kids and the man's raising your rent? I don't know. Exactly, so you go to jail. <laughs> but since you knew it, this, homie's going to give you another chance. Go ahead, move five more spaces. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, I pass go. Collect $200. Yeah, but when you pass go, you was in Mr. Charlie's neighborhood. So you go back to jail. <laughs> but I don't want to go to jail. This game's not fair. None of the man's games are fair, son. <laughs> I'm sleepy, Dad. Where's my room? Oh, that's over in the West Wing. Follow me, son. <laughs> Normally, I'd hit you upside your head. <laughs> but since you visiting, what the hell? Hush, little homie, don't say a word. Ain't that a siren you just heard? Here comes a car with flashing lights to rob little homie of his human rights. Which have been denied since every black clown in the days of our forefather when they cut off little Kuta Clown Tay's foot in the man. the oppression you're about to unload on me. Well, uh, actually, it seems there's been a terrible mistake. I have got to take the boy back to his mother. Apparently, he uh, ran away from home. Come here. So you ran away from home, huh? You tried to use homie as your backup. You have no respect for authority and decided to play by your own rules. I'm proud of you, son. I got a little surprise for you. This is homie's first sock. Use it wisely, my son. I will, father. Are there others like us? Yeah, but they're scared to put on the makeup. 
Well, I suppose this is where we have to hug and have that tender Walt Disney moment, huh? And I suppose to clutch your legs and cry as they drag me away from you. I think so. Homie don't, don't play, play that. It. It's a touching scene. Shut up. Now, both of y'all get the hell out of here before I kick you down the stairs. Yes. Hey, Junior. Get that to your mama. 